the tree. The shack. Now, the wheelchair. Yep. Pumpkin. Yep. The car? Hmm. Not much to say about any of that. But we just kind of confirm that what she's looking for is a man. Or at least she wants to gain the attentions of men. And who do we run into here? A lumberjack. No, oh, I thought that should still be open. The door's closed. The tent is closed. The shack is closed. Yet the beer seems fresh. And the fire is still warm. Now, to avoid grabbing, uh, to avoid invoking the wolf immediately, oh darn it, I didn't change my timer, did I? Oh well. You can do something here. It was already open by Ginger. Figured it would still be open. Guess not. Hmm. Oh well. Since you made a big deal about the fire, we will turn the fire. We will start the fire. Oh, big old campfire. warm glow caresses my skin, peels me layer by layer, until I am pure for you. Oh, come on, stop that. She did make mention out of wanting beer. I like how the beer is the old-fashioned three X's on a can. Like poison. Fresh out and warm in. Spinning head and bubbling blood. Well, I hate to do it. Because I really don't like where this is going. Especially right in front of the girl in white. Sneaks up behind the, uh, very balding lumberjack and steals his hat. Teasing the man. Yep, here we go. I'd say she got his attention. Right in front of the girl in white, too.
Here he comes. And sits down beside her. And they enjoy the fire together. Not much happens. But she does still have his head on. And he hands her a beer. you wanted. But could you handle it? I think that's kind of the central theme. The girls can get what they want, but can they handle what they get? Carmen, who once had the nice little shake to her hips to attract the man, and now makes her own broken and battered walk to the fence into grandmother's house. See, I've never seen this before. This will be my first time seeing Carmen's... Um, Carmen's grandmother's house. Somehow I don't think I like what I'm going to see. Or I don't think I'm going to like what I see. saw blade instead of a ceiling fan. That's... okay. And an X, like, that was marked on all those trees the guy was going to chop down. So her doors get the... oh, and she takes this door down into a basement, I guess. What's this? Stack of mattresses with a chair on it. A bunch of chairs sitting around a tree stump. In a pool. Oh, well, that's your shadow. She looks like she's holding her neck or something. Put a pool there with a funny looking tree stump. And a constant sound of like an anvil or something similar. I'm kind of interested to see what she's doing with her hands. And up a very wood paneled. All the fallen trees that the guy was cutting sure seem to feature prominently, don't they? All sorts of cutters marks. Wow. Now we're going through a forest. This is not changing my thought at all. And the new 
goose head. With some axes. Yep. And down. Almost done with this. Yes, this looks like we're close to the end. Ugh. Wow, the saw blade cut a nice gash in the wall there, didn't it? And a furnace. Carmen gets the closest thing to hell, doesn't she? And this would be her future final room with a tree just implanted in a bed. That didn't changed my mind much there, game. <sighs> Items collected zero. Really? Three rooms unlocked. Distance traveled 564 meters with the wolf encountered. <laughs> well... I don't really know how else to interpret that. Pretty, that seems pretty straightforward, actually. Most people I talked to about this one were right. Um, yeah, there is no other way for me to interpret what happened there. But it looked like she went out thrill seeking. Trying to, uh, trying to be alluring and all this with her 17-year-old sense of, you know. And, uh, yeah, she was raped. The only thing that I'm not sure on is if she was killed afterward. I really don't think she was. I mean, it just doesn't seem you know, status quo for any of the uh, girls to go through a physical death, but I'd imagine that, you know, I can't see how it'd get much worse than being raped, though. Hard for me to picture that one. There was one. Yeah, that was kind of disturbing a little. What am I saying? A little. This whole game is disturbing on a deep level. Oh well. That is it for this time. Next time when we continue. Our last girl, Scarlet, gets to walk down her path. So, until then, take care, everybody. See you later.